Okay, everybody. I was highly impressed, and I'm not cynical or funny here, by the pictures from the James Webb Space Telescope. So, I'm making a underwater video in its honor. Now, this is a Gobi Lubrico Gobis Exegios coming out of a black hole. And the Gobi is actually so swift that I slowed down the footage by a factor of three. So, so what's the black hole actually? It's a invertebrate tube in the sand. So this is underwater in the Philippines, in near Bacong. And so I believe this used to be the uh, tube built by a worm. And then the worm uh, died and then these Gobies took residence in there. If you look at the perimeter of the tube, what you see, these are the eggs of these gobies. So not only is it their home, but it's their nest. So, you know, there's this, this um, there are small pearls on the edge of the tube. And the other thing that's interesting, occasionally here you see this convection eddies. So the island is very volcanic. So the sand is heated and then you can actually see that when you're very close to the sand. Really interesting stuff. I love the gobies. These gobies with their bright yellow color. Now, this is the planet Uranus, as photographed by NASA. And I swam up to this fire urchin and I said, I'm gonna film Uranus. So the anal sac is what you can see in the center of this animal, this is this bulb, and these are, uh, they're living in seagrass meadows, so this is only about five meters deep, and you're probably asking how can these animals survive that are standing out like that, and the answer is they're highly venomous, so I once got uh, stung uh, just a tiny little bit and it was extremely painful like an electric shock almost so a yeah, great close-up of the anus the anal sac of the sea urchin in the center and so these are creases and here it's defecating so it's defecating sand uh, which tells us that they're, they're eating sand and they're, they're grazing the algae which uh, grow on these sand grains and then they're, they're pooping out the, the extra sand grains, the minerals only. So these are beautiful animals, very venomous animals. They are not particularly rare in the area in the central Philippines where I live and dive, but I think that, you know, that they're such a strikingly colored animals that uh, it's very tempting for me to photograph and film them. So, you can see I'm using my Enon Buck Eye lens to get this unusual perspective on this animal here. Now, what else did we see on this dive? We saw a Jean de Sheep, Sea Slug, it's a Sacaglossan Costasiella. So, this is a tiny animal the size of a sand grain on an algae. I made a separate video about it and linking to it. And we saw some major fish commotion. So these are fish which are feasting on something. And I also made a separate video on that. So you can guess now uh, what's going on there. And then maybe watch the other video for the resolution. I hope you enjoyed that. As usual, please support the channel. Share the content. Check out my other social media presence and see you soon.